Uh, now we're going to try to get some of the Mets up here. Here we are, Jerry Kuzman right behind me. Jerry, tell me, tell me first about that double that you ripped out there early in the oh, morning. Oh, you're really hit, Kuzi. I always told him I was a hitter, Lindsay. I always told him. <laughs> You've been saying that in Jerry Grody right there. Yes, sir, he can do it all, Lindsay. He can do it all. And uh, <laughs> and right, right here behind us. Yes, sir. It's Miss. It's Well, I'll tell you. <laughs> I was going to say happy birthday to Mr. Spacer. <laughs> let's get Don. Let's get Don Clendenin up here. Don, what did you what did you hit on the two two pitch? I think it was a slider. I'm not sure. Slider didn't, curveball. Didn't really care, did you? No, I didn't really care. Don, you had a great World Series. Thank you very much. I uh, would like to have done better. But like I, I told everybody from the very inception that we're a great ball club. We proved it. Baltimore was overconfident, but we proved that we're a great ball club. I think Mr. Mr. Payson has something to say to you. I have this. Thank you, sir. I have this to say to the whole team. Today happens to be my birthday, and who could have a better birthday present than these boys gave me today? Quite a present. It is indeed. <laughs> Don, when you came down from Montreal, people were wondering how long you were going to continue to play baseball. What do you say now? The season's over. Well, I have a two-year contract. I will honor my contract with obligations, and um, I will play as long as I think New York can need my services, as long as I can do an adequate major league job. Certainly, we'll be looking forward to seeing you next season when we start all over. Don Clendenna, let's get Tom Seaver over here. Tommy, got to be a big thrill. Oh, the biggest ever. I tell you, that you believe in this? Look at my one of my bobos right here. Hey, it's going on, John. Beautiful. Just ripped that one pretty good there oh. off the wall out in left center. Well, Lindsay, uh, this is the same ball club that been blown from the same field with the Baltimore Orioles, but we beat them. We showed them what we had, to, what type of ball club we had been all year. And we, we, we're number one. They we're thought they were going to run us right off the field, and we come to play. This is a right. club that played the way, this way all year long. We came from behind. We did it today, and you can't say too much. For this. Now, tell me, I want to ask both of you. Tell me, now, tell me sincerely, because I want to ask you this question. You're down three runs. What kind of feeling did you have at that time about your prospects of winning the ball game? We built it up all year long. It's been like that, Lindsay. No matter what happened, no matter where we were, we were down 6 nothing, and Pittsburgh came back and won that ball game because we never put our heads between our legs and we always fought and it's the greatest feat in the world. Well, then we, we're the type of ball club that uh, has scored late all through all during the year. We, we never give up. Uh, never. This is why we're here. Never. We, we get behind three or four runs in the late latter part of the ball game, we come back. Congratulations to club. both of you. We both had a great year. We'll be back here in a moment. Again, the final score was the Mets 5, the Orioles 3. In a moment, we'll continue to review the events of today's game. We'll be back here in just a minute. Come on up. Come on up. Come on up. Come on up. That a boy. That be up. We'll be back in just a minute. We'll be back in. We'll be back here in just a minute. Stay right here. We'll no, I don't. Stay right here. Stay right here. I want to talk to you. Aren't you busy, Be back here in about a half a minute. Stay right where you are. Hello, boy. Good. 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 We're in commercial right now. We're in commercial right now. We're number one. Thank you. I'll give him a kiss. You know what, Tommy? You what? smell like a horse. <laughs> we're, we're in the clubhouse of the world champion, New York Mets, and it has a certain ring to it. We have Tommy Agee here, Ron Swoboda, Cleon. And the mayor of the city of New York is about to make an entry here. Mayor Lindsay's coming up. What do you have to say to the Mets, Mayor? Oh, God, it's going to be the biggest celebration New York ever saw. <laughs> We're proud of you. What a lovely team. Just what did, what did the New York Mets in this summer mean to the city of New York? Gave us the biggest lift that we've had in a thousand years. Beautiful job. Tell them you're going to give them a day Monday. It's going to be a big day on Monday. Big celebration in the whole city. Big, the biggest, biggest you ever saw. It's going to be tremendous. The mayor of New York saying that Monday's going to be sort of a Met day here in New York. So get all ready for it. Did you enjoy the ball game? It's the best game I ever saw in my life. Never been happier. Marvelous. Mayor Lindsay of the city of New York. Tommy, you had a marvelous year and a marvelous World Series. Thank you very much, Lindsay. We were kind of up for the series. We knew we could beat Baltimore. And when they were talking so much, they gave us that much incentive to win. 
<laughs> they were talking so much they forgot to play. Right. Ron Swoboda was the last base hit, the biggest one you ever got in your life. Well, we've come so far so fast, I I think nothing nothing can really be said. You know it, Lindsay. You know it because it brought us here. It was only one of the things. There were so many things. Ron, you find you got the magic glove back. You got it all back. You can pick it. Who's me? You can pick it. Can he pick it? There's my buddy. There he is. Rod Gasper with a little uh, a little something for the mayor here. And he's got to return the favor. It's fair enough. Come on in, Charles. Ed, oh, Ed Charles, come up here. Let's get the glider up here. Ed, you've been in professional baseball. We're number one, Lindsay. It's a wonderful feeling. Wonderful feeling. And you were saying back in August when October rolls around. When October rolls around, the mess will wear the crown east side, west side. How about that, huh? Lindsay, what did I say? I said he went four straight, didn't I? That's Four straight, and we did it. Well, you won four straight after you lost that first one. That's true. Buddy Harrelson over here. But... Bud, you had a great, great World Series and a great season. Thank you very much. I think it was a team effort today as it has been all year. Once or twice, one individual would stand out. But overall, I think today was an example of our game, of a team effort, and fighting back, never quitting on the bench. And it's just a great year, a great team, and I'm glad to be here. Are you staying in New York now for the winter? Yes, I live here in New York, and uh, I'm looking forward to this World Series rubbing off financially. Right. The mighty world. What is it? I just trying to hit a single that time. You lead off hit. I just trying to hit a single and it just went out. Well, how is it now? You hit a home run off McNally once some years ago. Yeah, I got him in my book twice now, and this is the biggest <laughs> one. <laughs> <laughs> Had to be a great, great thrill. Oh, I, I can't explain what was happening to me going around the bases. I just it was so enjoyed. I couldn't laugh. I couldn't keep a straight face. You know, I, I don't know what I did. You know, a lot of things were happening to a lot of people about that time. Oh, it's, it's really great. You know, the whole team is just a, a great team effort, and it's uh, been a, a wonderful year.